Greetings and salutations. My name is Tish and welcome to the Artist Haven, where home plus art equals heart. In tonight's live video broadcast, it is Saturday night shenanigans. Woohoo! So, what that means to you guys out there in YouTube land is you guys get to pick the colors that I use in my painting tonight. So, without further ado, let me introduce my executive merch producer my love my darling my michael sean carter hello everyone <laughs> happy saturday saturday night shenanigans here we are here we are it is the weekend <laughs> yeah <laughs> that's my so, worst yeah! So in the chat tonight, we see Lady Mist. Hey, Lady <laughs> Mist. And there's our lovely moderator, Doris. Doris at DF Designs. Hello, hello. And also joining us, there's Kim. Hello, Kim. Hello, Kim. Creative Escapades. And then let's see who else we got here. Oh, there is Daphne. Hey, Daphne. Hello, hello. Hello, Daphne. There's Gina Binavici. <laughs> And let's see. Uh, San San Acevedo. Hello. Hello. Greetings and Greetings. salutations. Welcome to the channel. Glad you are here. There's the lovely, vivacious Cheryl. Hello, Cheryl. Cheryl. Hello, hello. And let's see here. Anyone else? I think I've, I think I've got everybody so far. There is, well, wait a minute. We've got a JMP. One two two nine, maybe JMP twelve twenty nine says hello. Hello, hello. If Greetings. you got a um, you know name that you'd like for us to shout out to you on JMP one two two nine, please let us know in the chat. Absolutely, we Same like we like Boston. being on a first name basis with people here. Yeah, because <laughs> so. we're all family. Or if you got maybe a little, little, little cool. Yeah. Handle, yeah, if handle. you like. Yeah, yeah. pass it on to us. Yeah. Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, so are there any colors anybody's throwing out there yet? I believe that I saw... Oh, boy, there we go. Doris is talking about her, her favorite blue. <laughs> Prussian blue. Prussian blue. I only have a little bit left, too, so. Well, at least mixed up. I don't know about, I can't remember okay, how full so it is. so JMP1229, that's Joanne. Hey, Joanne. Hello, Joanne. Welcome to the channel. It might take us a time or two. You might have to show up again and tell us your name again, because I can't remember the names that I gave my kids, okay? So it's nothing <laughs> personal. That's why I have, like, 15 nicknames for all of them. I've got so. a kid. I never see her anymore, so I forgot her name. <laughs> uh, yeah, this let's is what see. happens when they get older. San San Acevedo says maybe some Halloween fall colors. Yes. Yes. It is Halloween. Uh, and, anyone you know, in particular? In the chat. I see you. <laughs> we had to pull in some spooky, spooky effects. Yep. Okay, what is going on over there? All right. I love getting in the audio booth and, and doing stuff like that. <laughs> yes, Michael has a little bit too much fun over there. Right, Doris says I know her from Heather's channel. Is is that uh, Joanne or? I just put my finger in paint. Surprise, surprise. Scary voices. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yes, it's spectacular. Yeah. <laughs> Here's me peeling paint off the thing. Okay, y'all okay. need to start picking colors because I'm going to start peeling paint more. Okay, so uh, <laughs> San San Acevedo says black, purple, orange. Um, um, and then, of course. I'm going to use Payne's Gray for the background on this painting. So there's kind of a black. Bronze. Bronze. Do I have bronze? I think so. Yes, I do. Gina says yellow, please. Yellow. Got yellow. And we wanted orange. Hmm. Well, this is kind of a reddish orange. This is the cadmium red from Probably Windsor and Newton. All kinds of different types of fall Halloween colors. Yeah. Yeah. 
Okay, so we're gonna do those four. I need, I need it. Yeah, one or three more. <laughs> so let's see. We'll wait for some more colors to come through. So for anyone that's new to the channel, oh, absolutely! If you're new to the channel. Uh, welcome, first off, let me just say that. Um, and if you're catching us on the replay, thanks for watching. Um, if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe because we go live now five days a week. We were doing six, but with everything going on and trying to start the business and get a web page going and all the things, I needed an extra day to do all to focus just on that. And um, anywho, so five days a week. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. We go live every day and we have our Palooza and we have Testing Tuesdays and we have Friday Night Flip Cup with my pal Brooke and we just do all kinds of fun things. So make sure to click that subscribe, hit the notification bell and that'll let you know when we go live or when we post new content. Um, and also be sure to join our Facebook group over on Facebook. Just do at the Artist's Haven. That'll bring you to our page. Give that a thumbs up at the top of the page. It'll say join group. Click that button, answer the security questions. It's just kind of to help keep spam out and you know people that are just there to be mean. We don't want mean people in our group. So, um, and we welcome all artists from all walks of life, whether you, you do fluid art, resin, uh, you're a musician, you bake, you are awesome at landscaping or floral design. You know, everybody has a creative outlet and we are here to support you and to be a community for you. So, and, 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 and if you like this video, share it too. Share it out there on the interwebs. We appreciate that. Okay, Any other so colors? let's see. We've got Lady Mist is talking about blue violet. Blue violet. Let's blue see. violet. She had a like a diamond up there, but she said this color, blue violet. So also joining us tonight, there she is, Julie, Arizona Rock Garden Designs. Hello, Julie. hello. Hello, Julie. And this oh, is Sherry Faf. Art. Sherry Faf Art. Hello, Sherry. Welcome to the channel. Um, I do this is kind of a blue with a purple undertone to it. That's as close as I can get right now. Don't have I'm, I'm running it. I didn't mix any color for like two weeks before I knew I was gonna leave for the move. I didn't mix up any new colors, so and I haven't had a chance to mix any new colors since I got here because I've been unpacking and organizing and cleaning and oh, all kinds of crazy stuff. So I think we're going to stop with that. And bears. I know. Just so much stuff. Okay. Lady Miss says that works. That works? Okay. Yeah, it's a really pretty blue. It's got a kind of a purple undertone to it. So we've got the Prussian blue and the red. Yep. We're going to go with this. We're going to do a bottom bottle, bottom bottle pour and then we're going to put it on the spinner so instead of tilting it i'm just going to gently spin it gently because michael's going to be over there biting his fingernails if i don't do it gently because <laughs> you know hardwood floors and acrylic paint don't go well together although i did find out unbeknownst to uh michael i'm going to be kind of forthcoming here i did spill a little bit of paint i, I wiped it up let it dry let the remain rain dry and then Attacked it with a green scrubby. So, and the truth you can't, comes out. You can't, you can't tell. <laughs> he, he never noticed. So, you know, I, I'm being honest. <laughs> I don't know. I might have. I see you. Didn't see it. Yes. You didn't see it. Oh, well, I think I did. No, you didn't. Okay. Because you would have said something. I know you. Oh my God! Oh, something like that. <laughs> yeah, it would have been exactly that. All right. So I gotta get these scissors out of the way before I stab myself in the hand. No one wants to see blood. Okay, so we're gonna use um, Payne's Gray for the background on this one, and just because I wanted to do something different, I've done a lot with black and a lot with white. So what did I do with my knife? There it is. Yeah, talk about a knife and blood. No, we're going to use a palette knife. And we're just going to spread that. Well, geez, I'll peat. And we're just going to 
spread this boat. I missed my spinner because this makes life so much easier. And I don't know why I didn't bring it with me. I think it's because I used it like two days before I left for the initial visit. And it was still wet with paint. I think that's why I didn't bring it. Okay. Stop hitting the bottles. That's not kind. Okay. So we're just going to... And I'm just using my regular um, paint here. Um, my paint, regular paint consistency is a, I call it a trace three. So basically when you take your popsicle stick um, or tongue depressor, I use tongue depressor size um, sticks when I'm mixing paint, unless I'm just mixing a little tiny, tiny bit. Um, that means that it takes about a count of three for the, for the ribbon of paint to disappear. So, whoa, lost my touch. I feel like I need to decorate a cake now. How does that look? I, it just, you know, it's got that buttercream. It's got the lines of buttercream. So joining us in the chat, there's Virginia. Hello, Virginia. <laughs> okay, we're, that's good enough for now. We'll go back and get the rest later before we give it a spin, just so. There's Angela. Hey, Angela. Hello, Angela. Yay! Yay! And we also have RSD. Uh, whoops, I just jumped away from it. I'm sorry, I can't remember it. The time. teacher, um, what's her name? Oh, golly. RSD teacher 2010. I can't remember her name now. It's been too long. <laughs> I want to say Jen or Jennifer, but I don't think that's right. Cheryl, what is RSD? Yeah, Cheryl, Cheryl is, Cheryl's my backup. <laughs> Jessica. Jessica. See? Thank you, close. Jessica. That's close. <laughs> close only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. Okay, let's put the lid on that before I spill that. And we're going to go about the middle. So Doris is saying that we could go to Menards and we can get a big six by eight. It's, wait a minute, six inch? Six inch by eight inch? Do you mean six foot by eight foot rub? Is that what you're talking about? Yeah. Probably. The, uh, she's got yeah. six inches by eight inches. Cheap. Like yeah. Three bucks. Probably six foot by eight foot. Uh, I, 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 I'm, I'm aware. I just, I'm lazy. Yeah, we might. We might do that. We could probably. Yeah, Julie, my nards. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we could probably get yeah. some cheap rugs. Yeah. I think I think we've got some yeah. like some leftover carpet pieces too. Yeah, that, that's just something for me to trip over. I just be careful because I'm a klutz. I know me. <laughs> I trip over air. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I swear this floor jumps up at times and grabs me. It causes me to trip. It does. Okay, I gotta remember this yellow likes to take over, so I can't do too much. Doris was saying she had three foot by five foot, not big enough, went bigger. That's what she said. That's what she said. Oh, there you go. <laughs> oh, dude. Okay. Open says me. All right. See, this is part of the problem with having bottles is sometimes they don't want to cooperate and you got to force it. So when all else fails, you force it. There we go. Now we should be good. Get the gloop out. There we go. But I like I like using these bottles because it just makes life so much easier. You can when I was going, I mean I was going live seven days a week, so I, I just it was easier for me to just have it all all the colors mixed up already. 
I should have put some of that Prussian blue or the. Daphne was talking about those interlocking tiles. We've been looking at those. I was looking at those. Yeah, yeah that's a good idea. Um, like for yeah. workout rooms and stuff. I was looking workout at them more for the garage, though, just to keep the floor warm. Okay. Angela's saying she is loving the colors. All right, Gorgeous. you know, I'm thinking these are pretty cool. I'm going to put a little bit of paint gray in here just to help separate just a little bit. Just because I need me put a little bit of gold. Just a little bit. There we go. That's the one thing I forgot to grab. I do have some down there. Okay, cool. Okay, we're going to lift this up. Give it a turn. Set it back down. And I'm going to start with the bronze again. Okay, and then the red. This is kind of a, like I said, it's kind of a reddish orange. Should be good. A little bit there. There we go. And then the Prussian blue. So, Art of Palooza on Wednesday um, is going to be a regular Art of Palooza, but. Um, Coming up the 28th of October um, is when we're going to have our auction of Halloween themed stuff for um, a fundraiser for Scares That Care. So mark your calendars, 7 p.m. I'm going to be setting up that live on Monday. Um, and we have artists from all over the country and the world participating in this. So I'm excited for that. All right. Where did my straw go? Any ideas? Haha. -ha. No, that's not it. That's the one that's still wrapped. Aha, here it is. Ha, right where it's supposed to be. Imagine that. Okay, here we go. Now I just do that to blow the paint down. Yo ho, blow the paint down. Ooh, that bottom turned out cool. Okay, so this is my Payne's Gray. I almost said Prussian Blue. I'm missing the lid. I'll find that momentarily. So we're going to kind of move some of these bottles over. <laughs> kind of act as a barrier. There we go. Bring this guy down. There we go. Ha! I just got to kind of be mindful. Aha! I found it. It's right by my belly. There we go. Okay, so everything else is covered in plastic for the most part. Let's give this a turn. And there's Elisa. Hey, Elisa. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to take, and I'm going to use this tweezers, and we're going to pull this through like that. Whoop. And then we're going to pull one this way.
There we go. Um, and also for that auction that I was talking about earlier, if you yourself would like to donate something to the fundraiser, please private message me on Facebook and let me know. Um, I got one message from, I think it was Missy. She had some stuff that she wanted to do and I have to get back to her yet. But I think this is big enough. I hope it's big enough. It should be. It looks big enough to me. So, um, still kind of, oh yeah, we're good. Okay. This is painter's plastic. Um, I don't trust myself with, <laughs> with the napkins anymore since I had them totally disintegrate on me and it was not pretty and I was swearing and you know painting's supposed to be relaxing not stress not stressful so I stopped using napkins I love Fiona I love what she does she has more patience than I do because nope no more napkins for this girl okay so bring these corners up and in That corner, that corner, that corner, corner. Okay, do we got them all? Yep. Oh, not really. There we go. Okay, here we go. Slowly, slowly. Go. And that in the bin. There we go. And I'm going to put some paint down here. Nope. Here we get the edges. Any questions or anything, Michael? Um, everybody's just talking about the different techniques and um, that Fiona has magic napkins. Yes, she does. Yeah. I think she has Teflon napkins or something, <laughs> or what's that, um, that Kevlar or whatever, like bulletproof stuff. I swear to God, she does. I swear. Because... I've tried expensive napkins. I've tried cheap napkins. I've tried using two ply. Uh, and, mm -mm. No, napkins just don't like me. So we just go with the painter's plastic because I have um, <laughs> a lot of it. <laughs> and you could even use like a, a Walmart bag. You could cut off the bottom and then the handles. That's usually big enough. Just don't use the inked side. Make sure the ink is facing you because you don't want the ink to come off in your paint because it's it's uh, water-based ink. <clears throat> I think that'd be a fun way to upcycle. Goodness knows we all have enough Kroger bags and Walmart bags. and I say Kroger because we just went grocery shopping and... Good Lord Almighty. Of course, the reusable bags are in my vehicle, and we took Michael's vehicle, so. <laughs> All right, let's torch this baby. And then we're going to, like I said, we're going to give it a gentle spin. Well, if it doesn't want to spin already, geez, I'll peep. Okay, there we go. Just trying to get some of the extra paint off. I'm ready for that spin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know, babe. Acevedo, she's saying, are you going to, going to give it a spin? Yep, we're going to torch it first, though. Get some of these bubbles to the top. And that way they'll hopefully grow it uniformly. All right. Okay, I'm going to cheat a little bit here. <laughs> Is 
It shouldn't time. go any higher than this. Oh yeah, Doris is talking about that. Uh, she'll be doing the flowers tomorrow, 12 noon Central Time. Oh yes. Anybody wants to join? Yeah, I'd like to buy a vow. <laughs> Ew. No, I better not. I break some kind of copyright. Thing. Yeah, some copyright thing. Okay, so I'm just going to tip this a little bit more. So what did you guys do Saturday night? Yeah, we played uh, Spin the Canvas. Yeah. Tina says that was just, that was gentle, too gentle. Yeah, well, I don't want to go flying everywhere. We, you know, in my apartment, I had tarps down and plastic down, and I didn't care. It was an apartment. The carpet was probably older than me, which is saying something. All right, here we go. I had raincoats on. <laughs> no. <laughs> I had my paint. You've seen my painting clothes collection. I have more clothes with paint on them than I do nice clothes. <laughs> okay, here we go. I think we're I think we're gonna clear that. Okay, here we go. There. Oh, that's cool. Okay, that's really cool. I think I just got some on my face. No, you did not. <laughs> that's what he said. <laughs> <laughs> Finger smooshes. Look, I didn't even get very much paint on that. See, I'm very careful because, you know, I don't want to have to replace the floors. Because that's expensive and a lot of work, but it's kind of fun to do. Okay, I want one right here. Maybe one right here. This is the only smooshes I can do that actually turn out kind of the way I want them. Okay, so I'm going to torch this one more time because I see more bubbles coming up. And we are to the corners. And it's probably going to navigate, it's probably going to roam a little bit more. We'll put it over, I'll give you guys a close up and then I'm going to put it on the table top to the side so it can dry. And if you'd like to see this, the dried results for this, join us next Saturday and we will show you the dried results so how's that michael nice okay uh, starting yeah, this you know, point Gina mentioned we got that autofocus that, uh, oh is the autofocus on yeah it's on fire truck so you can see the lacing and the cells and the cool effects that bronze and the gold went really cool together. Yeah, really. Yeah. Doris was even talking about good choice of colors. Yeah. yeah. Very, I, I think there's only been three. I've been doing Saturday Night shenanigans for about a year now. And I think there's been three paintings that I didn't like and I ended up painting over. So three out of 52. I should go back and see when the last, when the first Saturday Night Shenanigans was. I have a playlist, so... Maybe we'll do maybe we'll do a trivia night and give away things. So, but there you go. Yeah. Now Julie does have a question. She's asking about the gold. What brand of gold? This is a 24 karat gold from um Deco Art. Deco Art 24 karat gold. The um I buy it at Michael's um with the 40% off coupon or even the 20% off coupon, because that's been the cheapest place I've been able to find it. Um, someone's saying that they had them at, they have them at Home Depot, but I don't go into Home Depot enough because my Ryobi tool that I want is there. And every time I go there, I want to buy it. And I, 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 I can't right now. <laughs> it's like, I had to move. <laughs> well, I didn't have to move, but 
I wanted to move. And that took that. We just had a little road days. trip to Michael's. Not too bad. <laughs> Paducah, Kentucky is not too far away. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I can order it online too. That's true. So, but there's that. I kind of like it like that. Oh, yeah. All right. I'm going to move this over here really, really fast so it doesn't trip on the board. Do do. All right, so I want to take a moment and thank you all for all your love and support. It's been a great week back. Um, I, I had to take a couple weeks off to, to move from, from Minnesota to Illinois, so um, that was a challenge and an adventure. Um, so thank you guys for your love and support and coming on back to the channel and hanging out with me again. Um, we will see you on Tuesday night. I'll be testing out some new products. Um, I haven't decided which ones I'm going to do just yet. Um, I have a bunch of new ones that I want to try out. So stay tuned for that live that'll pop up on Monday. I'll post it to the group um, as well. So thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate you. Thank you, Michael, for being such a wonderful host. I appreciate all your help. Um, remember, be kind to one another. Peace, love, and happiness.